All right, this is a 2002 Nissan Xterra. This tutorial is gonna work for pretty much um, any Nissan in that year, in that year range from, let's say a Pathfinder 1998, 99, Xterra 2000 to 2004 Frontier. They are basically the same vehicles mechanically. So I was, um, I thought I had the wiper motor burned, but that wasn't the case. The motor was moving, the transmission, let me show you. The transmission here, um, this is the part that goes in there. All right. This middle part of the transmission, as you can see, this just snapped out. So it wasn't holding itself. So when you turn on your wiper, all you heard was some growling sound. Nothing was, uh, the wipers weren't working. It was the transmission. So this is the transmission, the old one that I just took off. So I'm gonna show you how you, you, you replace it. First, you remove this cover, which is, to do, to do this, you're gonna need somebody with you because this is kind of annoying. You know, you play with the hood on and off. So when you come here, there is this um, antenna, antenna thing, you have to remove it. That's gonna help you, allow you to do this. And the hood again. So you come here again, you're playing with it. And then um, just watch out because And then you're gonna have this off. Once you have it off, you will have access. Those are the wiper points, like the points where you're gonna situate your um, driver side and passenger side is in the middle. Over there, so. You lower your hood. Okay, first thing, you can remove those with 10 millimeter bolts, 10 millimeter um, ratchet, whatever you have. It's a 10. Here, three. In the middle, here, three. Once you do that, it's gonna loosen up. The, the trickiest part of this job is here, right behind the motor. Okay, you have a bolt here. I don't know if you can see. Let me see. Right here. Okay. This bolt here, it is hard to get out. Not um not the bolt itself. It's just how the motor can move as you trying to unscrew it. So what you're gonna have to do is since you have to um it's a counterclockwise um movement so you're gonna push this down so when you push it down like this you're gonna have to put water whatever a brick me i use two um brake pads i put two brake pads underneath here and i was able to move this bolt loosen it up and then the other hard part is taking this off because it has grip here the way they make it is that they want to make sure not only the bolt is holding it, but the grip as well, right behind the motor is holding it in place. So that grip is going to give you a hard time, but play with it gently. Get your tool over here, slide it, play with it gently. You don't want to mess up the motor. And then eventually it's going to give in. Once it gets out, and then you get your brand new transmission you line up everything one by one. What I mean by that is this, you fold it from this end here on the driver's side, you slide it inside. And then when it gets here, the middle, you align it. And then the far end on the driver. You're gonna need a 916 or 15 
to do this whole thing. But, um, so to tighten it, I put my hand here. I don't know if you can see. And then I put my wrench over there. So I was doing opposite um, forces. So my hand, my right hand was tightening and my left hand was holding it into place. Because if you don't do that, the whole thing is gonna come up because it, it, it's supposed to move. Okay, so now that you have everything lined up, this is tightened. And then you tighten these, the middle, these three over here on the driver's side, the middle. To remove the wipers themselves, I used a 12 millimeter. So when you removing your wiper, they will be in position. But when you're putting it back, you have to put it in position. So this is not centered. So you remove it. That is centered in the bottom here. And then you make sure bolt it. Double check that. And then you tighten it. But before you do this, you go in the car, you, you turn on your vehicle, you turn on the wiper because you want to make sure the motor is centered. Everything is centered. When everything is centered and then you center your wipers here, you don't have to worry about a thing. And then put this back. Fairly simple. Don't forget your antenna. Saluting for your antenna. Now, passenger side, I make sure that it is centered or just in place exactly where it's supposed to be, driver's side. All right. Tighten. Right, the other, right in place, okay? So I'm gonna turn on the wipers. But first, I need to make sure the window is slippery because I don't want to do it on dry. Okay, first I spray some window cleaner. Make sure the window is slippery. Or you can just turn on your... So this is the moment of truth to see if everything is good. transmission for your windshield wiper the system has a transmission and a motor so sometimes it's not it's not the motor it's the transmission that's messed up all right have a great one guys <laughs>